I'm going to show you how to make your gaming video stand out using the PowerDirector Mobile Video Editor app. Let's do some fancy gaming. As you can see, I have a video game clip on the timeline. I don't want to add the gamer's reaction to the clip. So what we'll do is we'll make sure that our playhead is at the beginning of the timeline. And we'll go ahead and tap on the overlay icon. We'll make sure that we're on video. And we want to go to the location where we have the video stashed at. We'll tap on the video we want to use. It will tap on the plus sign to add it to the overlay track. Now you want to trim the video how you want to. It's up to you. I'm going to place my finger at the beginning, hold it down, and I'm going to trim this in. And I'm also going to trim the end part in so that it's the same duration as the clip above it. I'm going to hold my finger over it until I have that yellow bounding box, and I'm going to drag it right underneath the video game clip. Now I'm going to tap on the clip that I just added. And I'm going to use the icon at the top left with the two arrows. Hold my finger over that and resize this. Now I'm going to add a mask so that I have a circle around the individual who I want to show playing the game. So I'm going to tap on mask. And I'm going to tap on ellipse. Now I'm going to use the nodes to change the size of the shape and make it a circle. And now I'm going to tap back. And now I want to add a glow of a certain color around the mask to make it kind of stand out. So I'm going to tap on border and shading. I'm going to tap on the color. And you can use the bar here slider on the side to choose a specific color. And you can go ahead and move your finger to where you want the color to be. It's up to you what color you use. I'm going to leave that all up to your own discretion. Now I'm going to go ahead and tap on back. And I'm going to change the size. I'm going to make it a little bit larger. And I'm going to change the opacity, make it kind of see through. And now I want to go ahead and add a shadow, which will create the glow. So I'm going to tap on shadow. And I'm going to tap on the same color that was just created right next to the color board. And you see it has a glow, but the glow's not all the way around it yet. So we need to go ahead and change the angle to zero. And we're going to change the distance to zero. And now we should have a glow all the way around and it should be the same size all the way around it. So now we're going to tap on back. And now you can go ahead and drag the image where you want it. You can go ahead and use these two arrows here to make it larger whatever size you want it to be and place it where you need it to go. Now that your picture and picture is all fancified, you need to make your gaming video look cinematic and you can do that with this tutorial. Don't forget to smash my face to subscribe. Hit me up with your comments and drop me a like down below.